St. Lucia Estuary, the first 21 kilometers. This is the natural connection between the lake and the ocean. It is here when the magic happens, where breath is spawned and life is created. This 21 kilometer winding channel was the home to thousands of mangrove trees. The area was a safe haven for many species of marine critters that was part of the bigger food chain. The roots also acting as nurseries to small fish and crabs as well as prawn and other organisms like the highly endangered fiddler crab that once was a major tourist attraction. The mangrove roots also acted as a sediment trap during tidal change and the hippos moving in and out onto the land at night created tidal pools and channels as they moved through the mangroves to emerge for day or nighttime feeding excursions. These tidal pools and channels trapped the energy of the high tide and on an outgoing tide it helped push the sediment through the channel that was the estuary mouth into the ocean. During rough ocean and wind, windy tidal surges a white or light brown foamy froth was whipped up amongst these roots. This was the birth of phytoplankton that was swept out to populate the ocean during tidal changes. Phytoplankton is the only organism on the planet that has the ability to balance CO2 and O2 purely because of its vast biomass. This breathing biomass of single cell organisms contribute to the delicate balance of the Earth's ability to sustain life.